Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm coming back from my cousin's house right now. It's a kind of a long drive, like a half hour drive from Lambertville. So I'm going to be making this video. Uh, I'm not happy, to be honest with you, because I saw that Connor Barwin signed a multi-year deal with the New York Football Giants today. And to be honest with you, that's a complete salt move. If you guys thought that he was just going to sign with the New York Giants under his own will, um, just wanted to go there because he wanted to play football, no. It's a complete salt move. We did not resign this guy the year before we won the Super Bowl, and then we won the Super Bowl in our first time for our first time in our franchise history. This guy's a salty motherfucker. And honestly, Barwin, I completely forgot you played for the Philadelphia Eagles because that's how mean and malicious you were for our team. You could say, oh, he got all these sacks. He was a good guy off the field. Dude, I don't give a fuck. Once you sign with the New York Giants, after everything that we've done, after everything you've done for this team, you go and sign with the New York Giants, out of a pure pity move, that's bullshit. That is complete bullshit. And you know, I don't give a fuck if anyone stands next to you saying, oh, you're a good guy. You could sign with whoever you want. You could have literally signed with anybody else. But you signed with the New York Giants, who were 3-13 and 13 last year. You're at the twilight of your career, if not past that. And you're going to go and sign with a 3-13 and 13 team that's not going to be any better this year? That is a pure fucking salt move. It is a salt move. All right? You know how badly we hate the New York Giants. All right? A lot of us hate the Dallas Cowboys. A lot of us hate the New York Giants. It's kind of like 50-50 when it comes to that. It's, it's whatever you... It's your opinion. But the New York Giants, everybody hates the Giants. You go and pick the Giants out of every fucking team you could have picked. The Giants are going to be shit this year. I hate the New York Giants and everything that you've done in Philadelphia you can completely wash out right now completely wash it out Connor Barwin that was such a scumbag move by your part I was thinking about this all day I was like is it really that big of a deal that uh, Connor Barwin did this and I was like at first I was like nah because they're gonna suck this year but then I realized that Cop Pizzle and Bad Dog, they're going to fucking suck this guy off. Be like, oh, he's like Lawrence Taylor. He's going to be great for our team. We're going to win the Super Bowl now. That's exactly what they're going to do. They're going to hype out another fucking washed up player. That's what they do every single fucking year. And that's what pissed me off. Because this year, I didn't expect them to have any fire this year because they knew their team sucked. But now that they have one of ours, now that they're going to they're gonna fucking rub it on their face. Be like, oh, we have Connor Burrow and we're going to stick it in your face when we win. Fucking bullshit. Now, when we sweep them again, because they suck against us, everyone knows that. When we sweep them again, now I'm going to come with even more vendetta because I fucking hate you now. Connor Barwin, such a shitty fucking move. Such a shitty move. You were one of us, now you're the fucking enemy. Such bullshit. I hate when players do this. Fucking salty motherfuckers. I swear to God, everyone fucking loved you for what you did off the field in the city of Philadelphia. You go and you go and, and go to a division, hated division rival. Fuck out of here, bitch. Uh, that's it.